Hi, third, fourth, and fifth grade leaders. Thank you so much for leading tonight. Tonight is Operation Christmas Child Packing Party Night. And you guys are going to do that during your small group time. Well, yes, your small group time. Um, so what you'll do is once everybody gets in the room, eat and um, visit with each other. Once all of the food has been collected and put away, um, just so that we don't get pizza fingers all over all of our boxes, you guys are going to start putting together your shoe boxes. And I'm going to tell you real quick. You have a pile right here of shoe boxes that you will need to assemble so that you can start filling them. They're very easy to put together. Uh, you could make it a game if you want to with your kids, just like you guys saw on stage. Um, but we feel, felt like you guys were old enough to put your own shoe boxes together. And then what you'll notice in your room is they have all of the supplies laid out for you to start stuffing your shoe box. So I want to show you some of the things that you have. Every box will get a notebook and a hygiene bag, which the kids put together this um, back in August. They will also have a pencil bag that they can put in each box. There's a few extra boxes of crayons if they'd like to add that. Every box will get a cute little stuffed animal. These are amazing. Um, so every box can get a stuffed animal. Every box will get a um, package of silverware and a cup. And then um, you guys have a few extra things. Every hat, every box should be able to get a hat that are handmade by people here at the church. Every box should be able to get a pair of gloves. Some of you may have um, shoes. Some of you may have a few extra supplies. So put one in each box until you run out. And then when you run out, you can um, put a few other things in the box. And then you have a pile of what we call filler items. And what you should get your kids to do is select at least two of those um, to put in a shoe box. And once they're done with all of that, they will take a label and decide if it's a girl box or a boy box. And I highly recommend that we check off the five to nine year olds because of the items that we're putting in the shoe boxes. But if they feel like it's more of a little, little kid thing, they could make that for two to four year olds. Then once your boxes are full, um, close them up and you can put them out in the hallway. And one of our adult small groups is gonna be here tonight collecting all those shoe boxes and putting them in the bigger boxes that we use to ship them to, up to Samaritan's Purse in the next coming weeks. We're also still collecting our change. We're about $10 short of getting to our $150 goal. And um, with that money, we'll be collecting or purchasing Greatest Journey, which is what you guys will be doing with the kids starting in January. We'll be purchasing that for every kid that's a part of Impact Kids. And then if we have leftover funds, we will use those funds to um, put towards shipping costs so that we can track some of our, sh some of our shoe boxes. Um, after you are done with all of your shoe boxes, every single item is filled and you've put all of your shoe boxes are filled. If kids bring things and they'd like to add that to shoe boxes, they are welcome to. We have extra shoe boxes that they can um, put all of their items in, and we would love to exceed our goal tonight. We're, as Impact Kids, we're packing 200 boxes tonight. And then after that's all done, if you'll clean up your room like you usually do, and then you guys can head outside and play until parents are ready to pick them up. Thank you so much for leading. Oh, and I forgot the most important part. Pray for your boxes. You also have your letters that the, that the kids wrote, and I put all of your group pictures in every single letter. And if you didn't have enough letters written in your small group, I wrote the rest of them for you. And so make sure each box gets one of those letters as well. If you have any questions, flag me or Jennifer Palmer, and we'd be happy to help you guys tonight. Thank you so much for leading. I'll see you soon.